remember that Mrs. Zainab, or uh, that is the finance minister, uh, actually debuffed the uh, claim that Obaseki said the uh, president actually printed about 50 to 60 billion naira to give for allocations to, you know, to governors and all of that. And, you know, she said what Obaseki was saying is not true, that Obaseki was just lying and trying to make the government look bad. But I don't think that was the intention of the Edo State Governor or Godwin Obaseki. He just wanted Nigerians to know that Nigeria is no longer making enough money for itself, but rather printing new notes. And you know where that is going to land the country at the end of the day. So really, I believe what they should do is to encourage every state in the country to produce or even increase their IGR because that alone will help the country to grow. As it is right now, a lot of states are not producing anything. Most states in the country are not producing anything. Rather, everybody's relying on natural resources. And what are the natural resources we have? Even the ones we have, we're not taking good care of it to even make good money for the country. But all the same, uh, you know, Nigerians have called for the sack of finance minister Zainab Hamad after CBN actually admits of printing money. Wow, that is called a wahoo. But anyway, guys, more details I'll bring to you. But please, if you have not subscribed to our channel, what are you waiting for? This is Saffron Media, and we are here to give you the best, the most trending, exciting, reliable, authentic, sizzling hot gist from Nigeria, especially in the area of politics and many more. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. Help us like our videos. Yes, and of of course, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and turn on the notification bell so that you can get updated with latest happenings in Nigeria. Okay, my dear friends, without further ado, let us dive right into the details of this report as Nigerians have called for the sack of finance minister over dragging or basically of line. Uh, of printing that uh, 50 to 60 billion naira was printed but of course you know cbn has actually agreed that it did that for the government but why we'll find out in this report so stay tuned like this video and help us share all right guys it says right here that nigerians have joined the ongoing controversy surrounding the alleged printing of 60 billion naira by the central bank of nigeria cbn to support the federal allocation to the three tiers of government for the month of March 2021, calling on the federal government to come out clean by telling Nigerians not just if it indeed printed the money as alleged, but also the real situation with the nation's economy. It was reported that Governor Godwin Obaseki of Edo State kick started the controversy when he alleged during the Edo State Transition Committee stakeholders' engagement in Benin that the federal government had had to print 60 billion naira to support allocation for the month of March. The governor, who painted a green picture of the economic situation in the country, said, Nigeria has changed. The economy of Nigeria is not the same again, whether we like it or not. Since the civil war, we have been managing. Saying money is not a problem as long as we are pumping crude oil every day. So, we have run a very strange economy and strange presidential system where the local, state and federal government at the end of the month go and earn salaries. We are the only country in the world that does that. Everywhere else, the government relies on the people to produce taxes and that is what they use to run the local government, state and federation. But with the way we run Nigeria, the country can go to sleep. At the end of the month, we just go to Abuja, collect money, and we come back to spend. We are in trouble, huge financial trouble, he said. Not done, Obaseki released the bomb that has continued to reverberate all over when he said, when we go to FAAC for March, the federal government printed an additional 50 to 60 billion naira to top up for us to share this April. We will go to Abuja and share. By the end of this year, our total borrowing is going to be within 15 trillion naira to 16 tri trillion naira. This revelation has continued to upset many, including the Minister of Finance, Budget and National Planning, Zainab Hamad, and the Governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Godwin Emefiele, 
who both reacted but differently while the finance minister outrightly denied printing of the said amount and insisted that whatever money was shared came from the country's revenue. It may feel it tried to be smart by half without completely admitting or denying but rationalizing with such a hugely important national discourse. In her response, the Minister, Hamad, the Minister of Finance, Hamad, said the claim by Obaseki was not just false but sad, insisting that the money being shared monthly at FAAC is revenue generated. The issue that was raised by the Edo State Governor for me is very sad because it is not a fact. What we discussed at FAAC is a revenue that is generated and, in fact, distributed revenue is a public information. We publish revenue generated by FIRS, the custom, and the NNPC, and we distribute at FAAC. So, it is not true to say we printed money to distribute at FAAC. It is not true, Zainab Hamad said, with a bold face. However, standing by his claim, Obaseki called out the finance minister, accusing her of playing the ostrich and the federal government of monetary rascality in a series of tweets. Obaseki tweeted, while we do not want to join issues with the Federal Minister of Finance, we believe it is our duty to offer useful advice for the benefit of our country. The Minister of Finance, Budget and National Planning, Mrs. Zainab Hamad, should rally Nigerians to stem the obvious fiscal slide facing our country. Rather than play the ostrich, we urge the government to take charge, urgent steps, to end the current monetary rascality so as to prevent the prevailing economic challenge from degenerating further. We believe it is imperative to approach the Nigerian project with all sense of responsibility and commitment and not play to, to the gallery because ultimately time shall be the judge of us all. It may feel a while trying to rationalize and justify the action of the government and end up painting a grimmer picture of the state of the economy, even worse than Obaseki had done in his initial allegation. According to the CBN governor, it was the job of the CBN to print money and lend to the government, slamming the allegation by Obaseki, which he failed to deny as unfortunate and total inappropriate. Insisting that printing is a key mandate of the Apex Bank, Imefiele said the bank must always act to support the government, at times of financial difficulties. He said, if you understand the concept of printing of money, the concept printing of money is about lending money. That's our job. To print, it's about lending money. So there's no need putting the controversy about printing of money. As we are going into the factory, printing the Naira and start distributing on the streets. For us to see some people playing some Games overheating the polity talking about printing of money. I think it is unfortunate and totally inappropriate. I would like to advise that this should stop. We should all work for the growth of our country and not play politics. It is very inappropriate for people to just give some coloration of the world printing of money as if it is a foreign word coming from the sky. In 2015 through 2016, we were in a similar fiscal situation, but it is far worse today. We provided budget support facility to all the states of the country, and that loan remains unpaid till now. We are going to insist on the states paying the loan back since they are effectively accusing us of giving them loans. Most countries of the world today are confronted by not just the health crisis from the COVID-19 pandemic, but also economic crisis. I keep saying this. It would be irresponsible of the Central Bank of Nigeria or any central bank to stand idle and refuse to support its government at, its, at this time. Whatever we do in Nigeria is being done in any climate. So obviously we can see that the uh, CBN governor actually admitted to them printing money to the government. So what are we saying? I believe the country should learn from this and rather generate revenue for itself instead of printing cash. So, dear friends, that is it from here. Thank you so much for listening. Please drop your comments and tell us what you think about this ongoing crisis between the Minister of Finance, Governor of Edo State, Gordon Obaseki, and now also joined is the uh, Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN. So, friends, thank you for being here. Do have a pleasant time. Bye for now.